Hello everyone, and welcome back to Wolf Quest and a new dawn with our lovely golden wolf Lily, who is currently resting by the cliffside, so a little snack of meat that she stole from a cougar yesterday by her side, watching as the beautiful dawn crosses across the valley and reflects on the lovely light of the river down below, a place that Lily feels somewhat drawn to. Once upon a time, she had a dream that she met her mate there, a wolf named Romeo, and I'm not sure if we'll be able to meet him again, but I would definitely love to try. He was such an awesome wolf and he actually had a perfect compatibility with Lily, but she does need to grow up a little bit before we can search for a mate, and we are currently working with our lovely little girl by uh, trying to complete her quest to learn to hunt and kill two elk, something that Lily's really hoping somebody else will do most of the hard work about that for. So that's going to be a bit of a challenge to try to find the weakest elk possible. All right, let's go ahead and maybe pick this up. No, don't eat it, Lily. Pick it up. There we go. A little snack to take with us. And we're going to do a little bit of searching. So we're going to try to find... Oh, are these dispersal wolves? <gasps> Male dispersal wolves! All right, let's go ahead and at least say hello to those guys because Lily would want to make sure... Whoa! Lily! Okay, she's not very sure-footed. She jumped off a cliff yesterday, but she always tends to land on her feet. I just didn't expect her to be so completely ungraceful for a wolf who's so proud about her appearance. And, uh, you know, a little bit, a little bit vain. She's got a little bit of that going on. But let's go get these male dispersal wolves a little bit of a sniff, just to see if they happen to be her Romeo that our Liliette is looking for. Let's see. There's a wolf carcass? <gasps> okay. That actually made things a lot more serious. Let's let's actually eat our little snack of meat. Because now I'm a little... Come on, Lily. Let's go ahead and eat this. If we smelled a wolf carcass, that kind of changes things. That indicates a level of violence I'm not sure we were really into. But that also piques our curiosity. So who died? And what happened? There was a moose nearby. Was that an attempt at a hunt that went wrong? There's female dispersal wolves now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So were the female and male dispersal wolves meeting up? And I smelled that carcass. Oh, is that, is that, oh, I think that's a snack. All right, forget this old meat. Let's go ahead. And there we go. One of Lily's favorite snacks, actually. Oh, <gasps> look at the moose, he's huge. Look at the sheer size of him! Wait! Look, we already have a bunny that we just ate. We don't need to take you on, Mr. Moose. Is he really here? Look at him! He looks like he is gonna fight with us. His ears are twitching and he's watching us and everything. Alright, look, I'm headed out of here. Whoa! This is not okay! Is this why we sensed a wolf of the carcass? This is absolutely the opposite of okay! Oh my gosh. Is he following us? The moose is mad. Okay, I think that definitely would have definitely would have startled the heck out of her. Not to mention we have now run away from any source of the smell, but I'm beginning to wonder if that moose who is extremely smelly by the way, just look at all of that. Look at him. He's just a bubble of scents. I feel like the moose may have done something to the other wolf packs, my friends. That clearly is why we were smelling a wolf carcass. I wonder if that moose killed one of the dispersal wolves who perhaps was trying to go for him. Oh, that's really spooky. All right, let's go ahead and leave him alone, the jerk that he is. And, you know, at least the positive thing. Oh, that's definitely a cliff. Well, Lily, you're not very afraid of heights, I'm learning. And you seem to be able to let yourself down from high spots completely with a lack of grace, but effectively. So down we go. I mean, oh, look, there we go. Oh my gosh, I love how her tail is just like swirl, 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 swirl. All right, my dear. Let's follow this elk herd, the willow herd, because if there were a bunch of wolves around, and this is kind of a nice little chasm that it seems the elk herd has gotten themselves in, then maybe it'll be easy to hunt them. Oh, this is the rice grass herd now. No, I don't want to lose this scent. Oh, and was there a dispersal wolf nearby? 
Indeed. So another group of dispersal wolves, the males, were following the willow herd over here. So let's carry on with their scent. Is this still the willow herd? No, this is the rice grass. Did I just lose the scent of the willows? Over here. All right, willow herd this way. Wow, they really like playing along the edge of the cliff, don't they? All right, let's come up this way. There's a lot, yeah, there's some male dispersal wolves we might want to go say hello to. Maybe let them do all of the hard bit of hunting. Bearing in mind that that is just Lonely's personality, my friends. Apparently she really doesn't mind going up and down cliffs. I don't think she's afraid of heights. I love how the stories of our wolves evolve as we continue to explore this amazing mountain and just run into who even knows what you don't know what you're- oh, another cougar! You don't even know what you're gonna run into. <gasps> like dinner! An elk cow carcass that somebody else has taken down. That would be nice. Let's see, spike elk. Alright, so it's not exactly elk calf, cow calf, cow elk. Oh, 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 there they are! Okay, that's not exactly what I planned on hunting. And is that a wolf in the distance? I think there is a wolf in the distance, actually. So this herd is already pretty riled up as a result. And they're very close to the cliffs, which it would be kind of amazing if you could chase them off the cliffs, but I don't think you can. I don't think we're in anyone's territory at the moment. No, we are quite happily settled between all of the territories. Yeah, look, that's definitely a wolf. So maybe we can use that to our advantage. Okay, Lily. Let's see if we can find perhaps a weakened member of the herd. They've definitely already seen us. All right, let's test this one. Okay, she's very strong, so we probably don't want to test her. Let's try... How about this one? No, that's pretty strong cow elk. Did they already pick off the weakest one? Nope, nope, nope. Let's try this one. No, that's a pretty healthy cow elk too. Aha! That is a cow elk calf though. All right, let's see, what about her? Nope, nice and strong. However, there are several calves over here who have now been separated. Oh no, this is a cow elk but that's definitely a good healthy calf. All right, so we're definitely chasing the herd. It doesn't look like, look at them go, wow. And this is definitely more work than we wanted to sign up for. What is that? What was that? It was a fox, it was so small, I didn't even think it was a fox. And let's see, more of the herd are rejoining now. That's really fun to watch them like break apart and come back together. And we'll carry on with the hunt in just a moment, but where did that other wolf go? It was supposed to, you know, inadvertently chase the prey right into our waiting mouths so that we didn't have to do all that work, but hey! Those are some beautiful, beautiful trees. Okay, there was some good food. Alright, there's a lot of bunnies around here, which on the normal day would be really fun. And look at that tree cover! It's golden leaves! Of course Lily would enjoy that. Oh, what's this? Oh, coyotes! I wonder if it, we saw coyotes. Alright, let's come around. This little guy is lagging behind quite a bit. So we know what to do. Alright, get away from mom. Okay, get away from mom. Come on, Lily. Wait for just a moment. Oh, look at her defend the baby. That's so such a good mom. Dang it, Lily, you ran right into mom again. All right, run for it, Lily. Actually, this does not the strongest calf. So I, I think that this may be a pretty good one to try to go ahead and get. But let's give him a little bit of distance. This isn't so bad. Okay, and then run back in. We wanna catch our breath and just keep an eye on that little one. All right, go, 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 go. Wait for him to get a little separated from his mom. 
Good. Okay. Oh, that was finally- she finally got us with a good blow. Okay, run. And give him just a minute. Everybody recovers. Good job, Lily. I think that Lily can actually do this. I think that she does like targeting what appear to be the easiest meals. Why overexert herself, after all? Oh, and now we're in somebody else's territory. Ah! Well, sometimes that cannot be helped. Oh, I think we just ran past some dinner. I heard something. Let's see. Our dinner is kind of getting away now. All right, come on, Lily. All right, there he is, there he is. You've got this, Lily. The chaos that's going on. Sorry, little guy, this is just the way things go. We all need to eat. And the mom's not being like overly aggressive. Like she's not rushing us. She's kind of relying on us to. Let's give him a little space. Give him a little space. Was that a coyote? Oh, there's a dead elk. Well, oh, watch out, watch out, Lily. We're so close to making this kill though. Okay, watch out, Lily. Yeah, this is not the most experienced mother with chasing away wolves, I think. And then, watch out, watch out, watch out, Lily. So I really feel like we can actually do this. Especially because the calf is beginning to slow down. Watch out, Lily. All right, come on. Maybe the thrill of the hunt has finally reached her. Yeah, I think it has, because look, she's ready to go, guys. All right, but we're in another territory. Sorry, little one. Okay, move. Don't let mom get us. Wait for it. They're trying to rejoin the herd, too. All right. Lily is really, like, going in for the kill now, too. That was a neck bite. Without hesitation. Is that the rest of the herd? Look at them. Wait for it. Lock on to him. Wait for his mom to run ahead too much. Oh, she's circling back around. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. We're so close, Lily. So close. Oh. Come on. Ah, dang it. Now we're both like on our last kick. Now the mother is fighting for her child's life and we're like on the last bite. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There, okay, oh, watch out. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh my gosh, the elk have got back up. Oh my goodness, we're both on our last. Oh, Lily, can you do this? Is the fight in her strong enough? The sun is out. I feel like, I feel like she feels like she could do this. Just one more, just one more. Can you prove it to yourself, girl? She's dead! <laughs> okay, Ah. Oh. Don't worry, guys. We will go ahead and we will say that Lily just got knocked out from that. I will allow her to carry on this time because Lily is so important. And <sighs> I have to say, friends, I'm really relieved that that little cow elk made it because I was really cheering on for the elk calf and the cow elk at the end. And I cannot believe that he literally got up in the last seconds and managed to survive. So Lily, it just wasn't meant to be. And I, I think she's lost the only life I will allow her. And this has been a very, very serious and humbling lesson for her to be able to reflect on. It is not easy for the life of the wild wolf. And now she got knocked out, almost killed by those cow elks. And she thought it was going to be so easy to be able to pick off one of the younglings and be able to eat it, but definitely wasn't. So we're gonna have to reassess, gather our strength and manage to take out some food uh, somewhere else. So let's look for an easy meal. Hopefully something will be nearby. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. Holy territorial pack marking. That is like one of the most extensive pack markings I've ever seen. The junction pack 
they're not messing around this time. They're, they're definitely declaring this their home. So we probably don't want to go mess with that, but there is food nearby, a buck deer carcass somewhere nearby. And it would be so nice just to have an easy meal that we could snatch without having to do any of that terribly hard work. But we do need to actually kill a couple cow elk if we're ever going to hope to have a mate and learn how to hunt. So we're gonna gather up our strength, maybe go to patrol and see what the, uh, the local dispersal males look like first. All right, let's see. I can smell that there's a carcass this way. And Lily did let herself get caught up in the heat of the hunt and we still managed to get completely destroyed. So we're gonna have to be a little bit more careful with that. Is the carcass anywhere nearby? Ah, there it is. All right. And there's not quite as many pack markers over here. So maybe this is an okay spot to sneak in and grab a meal. All right, now we're back into their territory. And have we almost found lunch? I don't know. But we do need to get our strength back up after that terrible battle. And that is the only, like, the only, because I haven't been in Wolf Quest in so long, friends. I just feel badly. That was Lily's fault. Not, like, that was not Lily's fault. It was mine, I'm trying to say. That, uh, that battle went the way that it did. Oh, there's some easy dinner. Excellent. Oh, that's a coyote. Oh, it was chasing a bunny. And it's, it's probably absolutely petrified. Suddenly the hunter becomes the hunted. All right, let's see, anything down here? This is definitely leading us deep into what could very well be enemy territory. Mule deer fawn carcass. And I don't see any food here. Ah, it may have been a stray lead. All right, friends, I don't know about this. There's another carcass, elk cow carcass down here. All right, I think we're going to try to follow our nose. Oh, we walked across a little stream. Hopefully get an easy meal out of this. Recover our strength and then reassess what it will take for Lily to be able to claim her own little spot in the sun. And I will say that that is the... Oh, what's that? Oh, get out of here, you little coyote. Excellent! Free dinner! We're not even very hungry, but hopefully this will just, like, help us out. We'll grab a little bit of a meal. Maybe we'll take a little trot. Let's go down to that river. And I would very much like to not be caught up in somebody else's territory for the night. And I think we're going to try to return to those beautiful golden trees. Or maybe even just the river. Just you know, a quick rest would probably be plenty. I could see Lily feeling pretty confident about just a quick little rest. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. But I will say, guys, that that is the only, uh, like, oops I will actually give Lily. Because as you guys know, Lily has two brothers, Crow and Silver. And they have both had their chance to experience the trial of the wild here. They did quite well. And Silver actually has a litter of puppies that he and his mate Marigold ended up having. There is a mama bear and a baby bear behind us. Oh my gosh. And the bear just stood up on her hind legs. That is so amazing. But Lily does have her brothers and they do already have their wolf pups. So the generation of the Dawn pack would still go on. And I think after this, it's going to be permadeath. So let's cheer Lily on. Hopefully we'll do better next time. And I will see you guys then. If you could, do please leave a like for uh, the, baby, the baby elk actually, because he got to survive. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.